Hello, what's happening everybody? Hope you're having a beautiful and amazing afternoon. So very happy to be here for our 2780 show here on Twitch. Let me get all cut up with the fight over here in chat and your wonderful support and then we'll kick off the NGC. Feel free to throw out some name suggestions for this fine vessel. What's up, Zen Saucy A, 10 more push-ups, Cowboy FL. Hey there, Lou the Seventh. Enjoy that lurk. Kinjara, Bone Snail, Shaw696, Ties for a second, Wiki Wiki Man, Frankenfurter. Hey there, BMFG, Varvikvik, Hojo Dan, and all the rest. Hey there, Hobbs. Good to see you, man. All right, hey, before I get started here, uh, Pojo Dan, thanks for 19 months, Kinjara6677, and Zen A, thanks for 24, appreciate that kind message too, and before anything else, let me also say thank you to Grebzy, who donated $25 while the show is offline to get added to the Forever Name and Game List, will be the first name added here uh, in our playthrough. Yo, WJMV, thanks for 43 months, dude, 43, heck yeah. Let me see one thing here real quick. Okay. We good. Oh, some very good suggestions here. Thank you. Yo, Frost DMB, thanks for 37 months. 3-7. Yo, Sherbinator, thanks for 43 as well. Thank you all for this hype train. Much appreciation. All right, let's combine a couple here. It'll be the Cruel Spud. Spud. There we go. All right, let me go ahead and see where I'm at on the names list. There we are. Uh, first things first is Grebsy. Thank you again. We got Zealousy. And Elusive. All right, very good. Uh, let's kick it off. If you're new to FTL, it is the roguelike game of space exploration. Our goal is to work our way through eight different sectors of randomly generated space on our way to a three-phase flagship fight. Uh, this square right here represents one sector. The lines within are the fleet uh, pushing us forward, forward towards the exit into sector two and beyond. Cool. Uh, NGC is a very interesting vessel. It starts with dual laser and hacking, which is very strong, but only has three weapon slot systems and also starts with a beam drone. Uh, I think the one of the main advantages of the NGC is the venting on the ship is very good. You got a vent right in the middle. You have three vents on the side uh, and you also have a vent here. It's maybe a little bit weak on this side and in the weapons room, but overall pretty manageable for boarding events. Yo, Pulb, thanks for three months, dude. Thank you. All right, well, let's uh, let's go here. You can see that our exit is more than half past the halfway mark of this line here, so we can get all three nebulas and still reach the exit when it's inside this line. Okay, let's go up here. The run begins. All right, we're going to fight this ship. So if we hit weapons once, we're safe, but if we don't, maybe not. I'm not going to use a beam drone here because it's not necessary. Okay, we did hit. Good. Let's take a little peek what's going on. Okay, they have a rock and an NG, huh? Very interesting. Getting an O2 kill here is probably not going to happen. There probably is a way to actually manufacture a crew kill here, but I'm going to do so on ships that aren't going to be able to damage me very easily. Hey, me too, Pulb. FTL's a great game, dude. One of the best. One of my favorites, for sure.
Seven missiles, two drone parts, eight scrap is like not a bad deal, man. Not a bad deal at all. I think I'm going to pass. So I think scrap is king in the early game. We can definitely do better than that for scrap. Hey there, bearded flames. What's good? Alright, not bad. 16 scrap. I'll take it. Okay. So, this ship could possibly damage us. This fires at 10 seconds, this fires at 12. I'm gonna go ahead and just hack weapons. I think we can get away without using a beam drone here if we do that. I also don't believe Rebel Fighter will be running from us. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm going to hack right after the laser fires. And this will make the beam fire before the laser next time. Also, by hacking weapons, we keep it under control. By the time they're able to repair and get them back on a similar timing, we'd be able to hack again. Okay. Probably wants healing, then. Let's go for shields now. Oh, enemy FTL charging, you don't say. Okay, I'll pop a beam drone then. No problem. No problemo. Uh, nah. Okay, enemy FTL charging as well. Oh man, look at this one. Alright, if I can get a hack out on the weapons here, I will. No, they got a big cloak. Big cloak. Um, too late. Hmm. Let's see where this volley lands, huh? Our shields got hit, which is not awesome. I'm just going to go ahead and hack weapons here. Okay, engines are down. Beauty, let's just go ahead and hit here then. That was not too bad. Could have been worse. Weapons getting hit there could have caused a complication which allowed them to flee. But that didn't happen. Right. There is a way to do this. It's toggling the shields, but if I hit one of the weapons again, we're okay. So, it's either going to be a weapon hack or it's going to be something else. Let's go weapon hack first. By, by doing this, we can uh, disjoint the weapons again. So, after this fires, I'm going to start my hack, but I'm going to toggle my shields real quick. Go. Oh, I toggled it wrong. Fair enough. 
Sounds like human or engineer getting in there. There's the human. Spray the O2. Okay, they got level 202. That's tough. Okay, enemy FTL delayed indeed. That's actually pretty nice. But I'm gonna ignore their pleas. More, more scrap, please. Reveal. Okay, okay. Well, that sure is a lot of fights on the way to the exit. That's nice. The one thing I'm not seeing here is uh, access to a store. I, mean, I could maybe get this one if I want to dive. That's possible. Okay, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, this would be the eighth jump. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then possible dive to the store. I mean, hard to, hard to argue against having nothing but ship fights for the entire sector. Seems good. Yo, Zero Saber, thanks for 81 months. 8-1. Appreciate that. All right, now this is a forward scout of the Rebel fleet, so they are trying to run. Um, so I'm going to load up beam drone here. I'm going to hack weapons. I'm going to wait till the beam drone is almost at the peak of where it's going. I'm going to turn it off. I'm just going to run to doors here real quick. Keep it simple. I only got damaged two systems here to pull the guy off piloting since he's boarding. And we're going to hack after the heavy laser goes off. Okay, beam drone. Okay, hit piloting. That's not awesome. I need that to move, actually. Okay, teleporter still going, damn. Okay, right there. Okay, two systems are damaged now at least. That's good. Okay, that's very good. Now the shields are down. Okay, very good. Tens fight there without drone uh, toggling like that. That was probably a very painful experience. Yo, Storol, thanks so much for 61 months. Appreciate that five plus year. Thank you. I have no interest in no pause, Zorian. Being the first to do no pause is good enough for me. Three full sets on the YouTube. If you're looking for that experience. Oh, attack the automated ship to get to the sensor station sounds good. The ship can't damage us, hooray.
Boy, the two shield sure is a beauty. Solves so many problems in Sector 1, Sector 2. Alright, we already had the reveal, but, you know, seven scrap is seven scrap. Um, okay, we're gonna fight the ship here. Uh, this one does have... It doesn't have very much health, but it does have a missile launcher. So I can either hack weapons here, which doesn't seem like a bad idea, or I can go for a shield hack to try to get a faster disable. Okay, well, they do have a, a mantis inside weapons. This makes me a lot more inclined to do this. I'm also going to load up a beam drone here. And they do have a missile launcher, right? Okay, go here. Looks like a Lado missile as well. Okay, engines are hit. That's nice. I don't need this shield anymore. Let's get this bad boy lined up. Nice dodge. Alright, well, cool thing here is manas uh, take 15 seconds to repair a single system, and then hacking on the system also makes that take longer, so we're looking at, like, tw over 20 seconds for one repair. That's tough for them. Yo, Darth Feratu, thanks so much for 29 months. Appreciate that continuation. Um, all right, so we're going one, two, three, four, five. Asteroid. Okay. This ship can technically damage us. I'm going to use a beam drone here instead of hacking. So what I'm going to do is load up the beam drone and then um, wait for it to almost fire. And then when an asteroid hits the shields, I can toggle the power here. Okay, there we go. Oh, it killed my drone. That's fine. Just hit shields. Okay, well, that should be that. No surrender for you. Swarm missiles. Interesting. Uh, I wouldn't say swarm missiles are good, but they're definitely something. Something we can work with, even. I might get those online before diving. Well, you do start with 25 drone parts, Mr. Mindless, so I don't think it's too bad. Okay, ship can't damage us. Auto assault, and there is a outpost here, so guarantee double reward. Uh, potentially Osinazar, it can be, sure. But not always. I would say the advantage for defense drone is larger than the advantage for enemy offensive drones. But you got a good thought there.
Hey there, Dr. Danger PhD. Thanks for 29 months. Thank you. All right, 10 and 12. Really nice scrap sector here so far. All right, we're going to fight the ship. Okay, it's unlikely this ship damages us. Can we do anything cool with that? Huh. I wonder if the Manus is the repairer here. Let's find out if it's true or not. Okay. That. I guess we're just snagging some free repair skill here on Zealousy, I guess. Alright, double fire. I'll just vent that. That's manageable enough. Okay, gotta watch the doors here. Missed. Okay, empty room. You know what, let's just wait for the rest of the missiles since they've gone this far. A six. Okay, that could be that could be a problem if we didn't repair it. Empty room again, okay. Missiles here. Max missiles. Alright, finally missed one. Right, let's see if the Mantis is the repairer. Okay, they do have level 202 as well. It's very unlikely now that we're able to kill the ship. I'm actually going to wait for the O2 repair to finish, and then I'm going to damage shields. Um, this way, if they try to run, I can use the beam drone. But with the med bay, double engineer, and level 2 oxygen, and only 7 hull. Getting a crew here is, kills here is possible, but it's very unlikely. Okay. Good. Dock and rescue? Alright, that'll happen. Strongly considering diving here. Um, board and look for survivors? Oh, we didn't clone. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Well, that's tough. That's tough. Forgot that event was one that can take the crew through Clone Bay. Uh, let's go ahead and let's hit up this store. In worst case scenario, I upgrade engines, and that's not bad. All right, we got lasers here. We got backup battery, mind controls. Interesting. I 
can definitely sell Defense Scrambler here too, though it does have its uses. It allows the Beam Drone to operate for more time. Yo, Big Bear Cruise, thanks for 46 months, man. Appreciate that a lot. Alright, let's begin by going here and here and two power bars. Alright, certainly a start. I'm just going to run him back to engines here, I think. I'm going to hold on to the defense scrambler until I can trade it for something. Right now, doesn't seem as useful. If I could have seen that store before diving, I wouldn't have dived. Put it that way. Um, okay. I'm going to hack... I believe weapons here, and that'll give us the most time possible to charge the swarm and possibly take this down. Yo, Pastrami, thanks for 65 months. Thank you. Nice. Yo, Airborne Heart, thanks for almost 70 months of support as well. My man. Thank you, thank you. Alright, we're out of here after this. Easy peasy. Only got hit by the ASB. Very acceptable dive. Yo, cheers on that, Con Insanity. Will do. Okay, tough. Um, so I can take one jump before the store here. I do have enough stuff to sell off the, between the Swarm and the Defense Scrambler. We can still pick up, like, a weapon here. But I'm gonna take this jump first. Attempt to follow and help them. Okay. okay the ship does have med bay. But it cannot damage us. I'm gonna go down here. Right, they're in the hacking room. Just hit shields here. Third consecutive hit here, we're in a good spot. Okay, we missed. I'm a little worried they're gonna try to run, and if they do, I gotta use the beam drone. Okay, they're in the O2, we can vent that real easy. is fine. They're not going to board anymore. That's nice. Oh, okay. Four fuel, one drone part, ten scrap. Nah. 
More scrap, please. Alright, 19 is a good amount. Here we go. Long range scanners. All right. Guess we'll sell defense scrambler for long range scanners. Gonna buy a couple of fuel here in a small repair. All righty. I'm going to go here and take all three nebulas. We'll see. We'll see. Yo, Con Insanity, thanks so much for 116 months. 116. Thank you. Hmm. I can also just grab one more on the way down. One more nebula is not all that beneficial. Let's keep this one in range. Hmm. Just right here. Okay, let's continue. Alright, so this ship can't damage us. And what do they got going on for repairs? They have a mantis repairing. Awesome. So, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to hack O2. I'm going to fire out. I'm going to start my hack. Okay, double fire in there is actually not ideal, but fine. This is going to put a hurting on him. I think after this, one of them's gonna try to move to repair the fires here. I guess not. Okay, as soon as this is repaired, I'm gonna let them out of the room. Okay, letting them out, and then we're gonna let them back in. We're gonna fire out here. Oops. Should have started my hack beforehand. Oh well. All right, looking good. Yo, Tabby893, thanks for 53 months. Thank you. All right, three fuel, 17 scrap. Not bad. Okay, there is a store down here. Glad I, glad I looked. I'll take uh, one more jump nearby Sun and uh, jump to the store, huh? What am I going to get at the store right now? It's a good question. With one more jump, maybe something like a flak. Okay. So on this ship, I'm going to use multiple resource. I'm going to hack weapons. I'm going to load up the beam drone. So this is an Artemis missile. Okay, at least both didn't miss. Yeah, that's basically a miss. Oh. Oh. I think I missed it there. Yeah. Oh, no, I had it. I had it. Fair enough. I think the missile might take out my drone here. Yeah. It's honestly not the worst thing to happen. Especially since the missile launcher went down. Alright, let's cover the uh, shield fire first and I'll vent this out. Thank you. 
<laughs> Still hit? Okay. That's fair. Okay, if he steps out of that door, actually, it's pretty bad. Okay, let's go down here. Alright, not bad, not bad. Tricky fight, for sure. 14. Okay, defense drone is actually very good here. It's not quite the weapon we need, though. Mm, I'm very tempted to pick up Defense Drone. Especially knowing we're not really getting another store this sector. I think, I think that's a good play. Let's go ahead and buy Defense Drone. And with my zero scrap, I'm going to buy nothing else. Defense Drone at least protects against the worst-case scenarios right now. Alright, let's offer assistance. Defense Drone immediately pays off, and we get a weapon out of it. Wow. Wow, Z. Can I stop this from burning out? Probably, if I cut O2. That's a big time right there. 25 scrap, and now we have four lasers instead of two. Now we gotta survive to the next store, basically, but uh, feeling pretty good. Just gonna get the extra weapon power, and then we'll stop there for a minute. Four lasers, defense, drone, and hacking is pretty safe in Sector 3. One, two, three, four. Okay, calm down the infected. There we go. Looking good. Okay, we got more than 25 scrap now, so I'm going to buy weapon power. Go. Looking good. Let's get to the sensor station here. This ship could technically damage us, though it's very unlikely they will. Gonna go for the heavy lasers, that's the facilitator of the damage. Yeah, I might dive here on Great Rain, depending on what the situation is. It's only a two-shield ship we'll be up against, so... It's possible. Very nice.
Yes, we did get a reveal, and there is a store back here. Interesting. Well, no matter what we do, it starts with one, two, and then we either go three, four, or we just go. Probably not going to dive here. Stock and try to rescue. What's up, Jones? It's a big deal getting Jones here. All right, Jones can be engine, dude. Actually, you know what? Let's swap a Rooney here. Let's put the Lanius on engines and put the Rock on piloting. Jones gonna get a new name. That name is Zarinma. Investigate the battlefield. You know, I don't think we're going to be able to manufacture enough to do anything at the store, and we are at 14 hole, so uh, I think taking uh, basically guaranteed 3 damage on the dive plus whatever else isn't worth it right now. Um, if I had full hole here, I'd be very inclined to dive. Let's see, I could sell Swarm and Beam Drone for 47 scrap. Yeah, we're not really in distance to buy anything. I'll just save for my next store. I don't see the point. Okay, NG control on the NG ship with an NG here. Yep. Alright, immediate store here. Fine. Hole laser 2. I think no on hole laser 2. Let's go ahead and buy fuel and repair here. Do I get rid of anything? I could probably get rid of the swarm now. The swarm does have some good utility here. I think beam drone is still a lot more useful going into later game. So I'm going to sell swarm here so I can have fuel and a repair. Oakley dokley. 23 is the number for me. Okay, at least there's no cloaking here. Let me use a hacking part on... Let's go ahead and go engines. This could be a two-crewer. Okay, locking NG away is nice. Knew there if I did two damage to weapons, the missile launcher was going down because there's only one power on the other side. Just, just keep hitting here. Or not. Okay, shields getting breached is pretty cool. Okay, I can just wait for this. The missile launcher is not going to be back in time. Okay, I'm going to wait for the shield bar to recharge too. I just want guaranteed damage. I don't want the I don't want the shields replenishing mid volley. Like that. That's what I didn't want. Enemy FTL delayed. You don't say. Good. We will not accept surrender. Oh! I was not expecting them to jump. I lost focus for a moment, that's okay. 
As it turns out, I am a human being. Okay, here we go. Um, they're going engines? That's fine. Right, it's actually kind of a scary ship. I think the smartest play here will be to hack weapons. That way I can at least disjoint them. Yo, Lugnock, thanks for three months. Appreciate that lurk, dude. Thank you. And now here. Good. Let's see what's going on over there. Alright, the Sultan's repairing shields. Our hack will be back up when this comes. I'm just going to go back into shields. I should have gone down here first. Interesting idea. Let's swing back around here and then we'll hit the exit from this side. This is a full two, uh, two dive here, so probably gonna go over here and then head back down and then dive. This, this makes a lot of sense as a dive. What I'm trying to get at. It's two full jumps behind. Okay, got a huge, uh, huge laser beam. This is probably worthy of an engine hack. In fact, I'm just going to go ahead and say it. I'm just going to do it here, too. Basically, if I miss my first volley, we're not in time to get the, the second volley off before this fires. So we can just guarantee the disable this way. Scrap a Ruzel. Let's count this out. One, two, three, four, five. So this needs to be the sixth jump, fifth. Now we can go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, dive. No, this needs to be eight. So it's. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Dive. Okay. Looks good. Is there any other pathing options we have? There's a couple. That look as good, though. Four fuel for three drone parts. Honestly, not a bad deal, scrap-wise, but I'm going to accept this, actually. Of course there's a store right there. Okay, does this connect down here? Okay, so I'm going to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Then. Yes, so we'll skip this jump to take a store now. And... Backup battery is the best thing happening here. Let's just buy some fuel. <laughs> kind of debating not diving now, just going one, two, three. I guess I can also just go four, five and skip this jump. So we can take the guaranteed fight right now. To skip this one? Sounds good. Attack the ship. 
All right, well, with a, a hack here, we can guarantee this disable, but I think even cleaner yet is just to use a defense strut on this fight. We're getting out for one part either way. Defense Drone has approximately 95% effectiveness on this ship. They got jukes, though. Yo, Asilius3, thanks for making it official with Prime. Much appreciation, man. Thank you. Well, given how this fight's gone so far, I'm going to keep going for shields. A little bit riskier, but... <laughs> we got a hit first is the problem. All mantis over here? Not all mantis, okay. And they are out of missiles. here. Uh, Zealousy is standing in no two apparently. Indeed. Oh, I didn't save positions. Okay, that's fine. All right, you go back here. Let's drop him here for now then. Okay, another ship that has... I might use two parts here. Go defense drone, and I'm gonna go hacking on. Oh, that's tough, actually. Weapons kind of make some sense here. Maybe could have held off on the defense drone for a moment. Let's fire into shields first, actually. I want to get a hit going. Okay, my defense drone went down. That's tough. Okay, he's got to go all the way through the weapon room, at least. Okay, uh, hit my weapons. So I only have dual laser left. damage is whole damage. It's 
gonna get two shields up, isn't he? Here. Almost. He did. Alright, safe to say I think uh, hitting weapons here would have been better. Let's just swap right now. There we go. Better late than never. Oh, nice civvies, thank you. Alright, let's let our O2 stabilize before we go any further. Two hacking is looking pretty strong. Ooh, interesting. Uh, I'm gonna ignore this station, though. You know, honestly, offloading and just upgrading the ship is not, like, terrible. Uh, we are using double drone parts, though, so it seems less likely. Alright, do I want to go here and then here and then dive or just go to the next sector I think probably just go to the next sector yeah let's just go to the next sector ng control their ng control we'll take ng control then All right, very quick restroom break for me, then we'll continue the run one moment. Alrighty, we're back. Thanks for your patience there. Let's get into it. Hey there, Crow. Nice to see you. Oh, hey, Crow. Congratulations on uh, surpassing your personal best on your streak. That was a heck of a Zoltan A run you pulled off for that one. Oh, we're going to be here and attack the pirate here. <laughs> yeah, okay. Um... This is where having two hacking would be very nice. But since we don't have two hacking, I think we're just going to exchange volleys here. Okay. Dude, a lot of NGs in the engine room on this run. Yo, Cass, thanks for uh, 80 months. Appreciate that big 8 0. Uh, 
Oh uh, yeah, I didn't see that one, Curl. Only saw your uh, Zoltan A there. FTL do be FTL sometimes. That's a fact. Okay, he's repairing. That's tough. What is actually happening over here? Okay, it's a human. So, uh, something I could do right now is fire into shields instead. I think I'm going to do exactly that. And if I hit shields, it'll pull the guy off pioting, which uh, helps our goals. Okay, now the engineer is the designated repairer. Gotta have it. Yeah, I got a little more time on this one, or not. Boy, brutal. Let's wait for this then. Just let him in. Well, you'll have more time to get to the repair. Ooh, the laser stayed online. Okay, it's tough. All right, give me a chance here. Uh, something. That is a pretty generous bribe, but... Good, it's a start. All right, that was a long fight. Oh, they jumped away. Fair enough, fair enough. I really think saving my scrap is the best play here. There's a lot of stuff I want to buy, especially to hacking, though. Okay, how about I buy two hacking, then we'll start, like, actually saving. Because two hacking, beam drum, plus the lasers can do a significant amount more damage than we have currently. Alright, missile launcher, three lasers that are on an off timer. That sounds like a defense drone to me. I'm also going to run over to shields here to, to kind of defuse this a little bit. Going right into shields. Okay, they do have value point in shields as well. It's a little brutal. I don't want to take a peek, but it's a little risky to take a peek. Man. Tough. Alright, that was the heavy laser hitting. Tell you what. Hmm. Yo, Rhinora, thanks for 22 months. Spellsiger, thanks for 87 as well. Hey, congrats on that huge accomplishment, Spellsiger. Best, best wishes in your next chapter, dude. I'm just going to go ahead and say I think there was a much more efficient way to do this fight. I just didn't find it. Okay, let's go here. Enemy FTL charging. Could load the beam drone here. It just seems I don't want to use another part, right? Okay, there we go. Four fuel, four missiles, 18 scrap. That's not a bad deal. 
I'll take that. I'm going to go here, I think. Nine jumps. Yeah, we got to go here. Yo, Coder Paws, thanks for 34 months. Thank you, thank you. All right, two damage to weapons here. We'll shut down the big laser. I'm going to take that. Just see what's going on real quick. Oh, it's all mantis. Interesting. Okay. Try this real quick. They got level 302 over there. Smart lads. Smart lads. What's up, NGs? Oh, imperative right here. Burst laser mark two. Holy guacamole and a tin hole repair. That is like life changing right now. Okay, uh, there's two stores coming up. Picking up cloaking at one of these stores would be really nice, but it may be better just to skip the store altogether and just get the Burst Laser 2 online right now. Cloaking would definitely be the thing I'd buy at the store. Mind control is nice too, but uh, I think we forego getting that for just a minute. Maybe I go like... Oh, these don't even connect up and over. Interesting. Okay. One, two. Yeah, it's plenty of jumps to get to the exit. So I either take one store and then the quest here, or I just skip the stores altogether. I think I have enough imperative upgrades that skipping the store makes sense. I have uh, the weapons, of course, three shields I want here in Sector 4 before Sector 5. And we're already rocking defense drones, so uh, we'll, we'll delay here. Uh, the first thing I'm buying right now is weapon power, because three more lasers added in here is a huge deal. Now we have uh, seven lasers instead of four. Not a small difference. Uh, I'm also going to buy two power bars right now, because then we can at least flex power into hacking and have the beam or defense drone online. This also sets up us getting the third shield. Scrap well spent. Yo, what's up, Ohm? The slightly trained weapons guy? Cool. Alright, you can be shield NG then. All right, Ohm's getting a new name off our list here. Thank you, everybody, for the support. That is Zarinma.
Oakley Doakley. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So this needs to be seven right here. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Or our other option be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I think that looks fine. Is there two Zeremas in here? By God, there is. Hold on. No, no doppel Zeremas. Make it mythic applesauce. Okay, there's a store at the end of the line, too. That's beautiful, man. Yo, Cass raised it, and thanks so much for that prime sub as well. Cheers. Alright, 32. Good stuff. Um, let's stock here. Buy fuel for 10 cents. That's a good offer, man. I accept. Good offer. Okay, here we go. Uh, convince them of their poor decision by severely damaging the ship. This is a guaranteed weapon if we pull off the fight. And by golly, a little bit of pressure here. Alright, I'm just going to go for a weapons hack because it makes me safe. Safer. Okay, as soon as these two fire, I'll start my hack. Much safer than the alternative, which was to just trade volleys with them and get a guaranteed disable. Okay, we're letting them live, return to the settlement. Hermes missile. Okay, Hermes missile sells for 32. So that's like, or 27, one of those. Definitely not a bad pickup here, going into a store in a few jumps. Participate in the study, stiff dough and scrap. These guys are all right. So, there's cloaking. Her scrap recovery arm, crew teleporter. It's 22 for Hermes. I was mistaken. Well, as much as I'd love to pick up cloaking, uh, I'm not going to sell beam and defense to get it. I will buy backup battery here. And this puts us on the, on the road to get three shields. Cool. You know, I really don't need fuel here, so I'm going to ignore it. Good deal, though. Okay. Another situation where going to the store right away doesn't make sense, though if I get a decent scrap reward from this, we could be in striking distance of... cloaking. Station may uh, help us out after this. Alright, so this ship could hit us, though I think it's pretty unlikely they do. I'm just going to try not using a part here. Alright, down to doors we go. Let's say if we hit at least once, we should be fine. Good. All right. Okay, uh, he's repairing that, so I'm gonna go. I'm actually gonna go into shields here. There we go. No pilot now.
Boom, 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 boom. Okay, 119 is still not enough to exchange up for cloaking without selling, um, like, the long-range scanners or something. I'd have to sell both beam and defense. I don't think that makes sense, because defense still has a lot of uses. Though we could sell defense to get, uh, to get cloaking. If we could sell one drone to get cloaking, it'd be fine. But selling both I don't think works here because if I end up getting to the flagship with only seven lasers, then the beam drone becomes an essential component for phase three. I'm going to delay getting three shields just a little bit longer since we have three stores in this sector and we have hacking. Though I think three shields is probably the correct purchase. Another option would be to go here and then come back to the store. But we lose access to a lot of beacon jumps if I do that. that is a, that's a lot of laser beam, dude. Okay, if we disable one of the two, though, we're in a pretty good position. So let's just go ahead and hack weapons here. Oh, great. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Double door mantis? Hold on. Yeah, that's tough. Going here for the moment. Let's close off this side of the ship, these two rooms anyways. And I should just close everything off. Open this and open these and this. Okay. Feeling better already. Let's get on piloting now. Okay, O2 just went down. Let's run over here and repair this. Hopefully the NG does not die on the way there. Okay, did not. That's fine. Okay, he's going back now. Two's going back on. Weapon hack begins. Okay, they're also not going to board again now. Oh, there they are. I take it back. No. There we go. Okay, that's what we needed right there. curious what's going on in there is this all mantis is it what's going on okay yeah there is a lot of mantis there all right now well, i'm gonna go ahead and clone these crew i don't i don't see why not move uh him back to engines let's move you here repair this and then clone
Uh, this is base FTL with uh, Rebel Fleet Pursuit Indicator in High Res Backgrounds version 2. accept this trade easy upgrade oh man that one reactor power is actually like a huge deal here All right, let's take the fights on the way down almost into cloaking range here oh let's attempt to download man okay it didn't work ship's not a bad candidate for beam drone but I have faith Ooh, I shouldn't have had faith there. We could have just taken damage big time. And as always, you can always see the mods we're using. We're doing exclam mod or exclam mods in the chat. There it is. 35. All right, no store yet. Asteroid field. I kind of like to avoid the asteroid field, honestly. At two shields or a self. Should probably take the fight as it's showing, though. Alright, so this ship has defense 2 and it has an anti-combat drone. Cheese and rice, Daisy. Can you leave your poor brother alone for two minutes? First and foremost goal here is just to disable weapons. Okay, because once that's done, we're pretty safe. Okay, they apparently have system repair or something going on in there. Maybe another NG in that same room. Ooh, double fire. Okay, six field, two drone parts, 21 scraps. Pretty nice deal. I think I'm going to take this. Except... This one's over the line. Like, you know, one, two, three, four, five, six is probably the play. Or I can go one, two, three, four, five, six. Well, let's just take this one. Now, why I hesitate is if the store is down here, then we lose access to these two jumps by not taking this route. We can still take this and make a choice after. I'll give you four fuel, you bet. 48 scrap, these guys are all right. All right, there is a store right there. I'm gonna go one, two, One, two, three, four, five, or one, two, three, four, five. Ooh, this does not connect down. Okay, that was a tarp. One, two, three, four it is. Send an away party to investigate. All 
All right, sell 15 for 45 scrap here. Awesome deal. Aid the civilian ship. All right, this is probably a defense drone type situation. Just as clean as our other options. Oh, they're going different ways? That's, that's weird. I guess it makes sense there's only a one-person room. See what's going on in there. Okay, they only teleported one back. Tough, tough for this guy, huh? Oh man, they stun their own manas. That's tough. I'm gonna cut the O2 so the uh, O2 stays out of that room. Build your own breach. All right, welcome aboard, Brecken. All right, Brecken's getting a name here. That's going to be Dubstep. Brecken's going to be the new shield guy. To the store. Right, cloaking's here, that's beautiful. Alright, so we're gonna buy cloaking, yes. Then we're gonna buy... Let's go ahead and get three shields going now, two power bars. Alright, some more engines would be prudent now to boost the cloaking evasion rate. Okay, before we go any further here, I'm just going to stand up, stretch real quick, use the restroom, grab some water, encourage you all those same things. We'll be back in just a few short moments for some more fun. Please do enjoy uh, the kitty ready for treats here on cam. I'll be back in just a couple minutes to continue this run.
Alrighty, we have returned. Thanks for your patience during that brief one. In a second here, I'm just going to reset the capture on FTL. Okay, where are we right now? We're in Sector 5. That's right, we just picked up Cloaking. Uh, we just got two Hacking. We're looking pretty okay. We got seven lasers right now. Let's go. Mm. 
Okay, but they've hacked our engines. I would rather hack their engines in return and then devastate their weapons. Or or not. Hmm. Okay, we do have cloaking and defense drone here. Let's just use defense drone as our our play here. Yo, Papa Need, thanks so much for that gift earlier in Biggie. Welcome to the Dapper. Thanks for making it official, dude. Three months in advance as well. Thanks, man. Glad you're enjoying the content enough to even consider that. I should really be going for shields here, which I'm going to do in just a second. Have you all noticed any uh, frame drops today? It looks like I have a couple. Um, this part is streaming, of course. Just curious what those look like for you all. Are they big drops or like lots of little drops? Just part of working with wet spaghetti for a living. Hey, cheers, Biggie. Well, congrats on that new opportunity. And uh, thank you again for making it official. I really appreciate it. Hey, man. couple little ones okay that's what i figured i think just in general the internet's infrastructure uh, is just a lot more stressed than it used to be i think unfortunately some some frame drops are simply part of streaming for the vast majority of people a minor inconvenience compared to the uh <laughs> compared to what the service is which is allowing us to interact live uh across the world Not a complaint, but if you guys ever see like a bunch of frames dropping at once, feel free to holler. Not really much I can do, but I'm trying to get a read on when it happens. Um, is what it is. Yeah, me too, Rapid Reply. We had the old 14.4 when I grew up. That was, uh, that was the time. Cool, thanks, Kappa. Appreciate that. Uh, 0 02 for 18? I might do this. I'm going to do this. I'm going to upgrade oxygen later anyway, so that saves me 7 scrap later. Uh, Uncharted or Slug Home? I want to go Uncharted here, in fact. Slug Home is a little scary. Yo, Anonymous, thanks so much for that gift. Waffle Codder, thanks for 62 as well. Thank you all for this hype train. If you use to share your resub notifications, subscribe, use bits, or gift. Got a chance some exclusive emo unlocks. But as always, thank you for the most important thing, which is the time you're choosing to spend here right now. They're all amazing. Yeah, frames are funny because like sometimes I'll look over as like like right now I got dropped 4330 frames of the stream, which seems excessive, but when you break it down into seconds, it's really not. If it's only happening 20 or 30 frames at a time intermittently, it's really not affecting anything. Still annoying, though, that's for sure. Probably a lot more annoying for me than you guys. <laughs> Yo, Anonymous gifted in five subs. Thanks, dude. Zealous, thanks for 102 months and relaxed one. Thanks for that tier three 113 month subscription. Thank you, dude. All right, we're going to attack this ship. Honestly, I'm not sure if defense drone or hacking is better here. Well, let's count it. Uh, we got one power here, two power here, and a missile launcher. So if I can do four damage to weapons, the missile launcher goes down. Because that's everything that's outside of the missile plus this. So I'm going to hack piloting, and we're going to do exactly that. 
I will cloak their first missile. Yo, Marlock's here. Thanks for 44 as well. Cheers. Okay, good miss. And there you have it. Yo, man, God, Rando, thanks for a thousand bits, dude. Cheers. What I don't want to have happen is this ship try to run away. Uh, I think I just saw fire start in here, though. That's a good sign. Let's go. Let's go into shields now. That's good. That's good. Yes, who is this secret benefactor, huh? That's a terrible offer for Sector 6. No thank you. hit there okay fair also fire going on let's just open the door yo thanks so much anonymous really appreciate that generosity thank you Yo, Mad God Rando, thank you so much for that FIGA sub package. Truly too kind, everybody. True, too kind. There it is, level 5 hyper. Beauty. Well, my gut tells me here that if I... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on. Hold on. If I hit their weapons, we should be safe. So I'm just gonna do that. I'm not even gonna hack here. Okay, so there's still an engine. Interesting. There we go. Give them the old suffocation samba. Time tested and honored technique. It came back? Why? Alright, 36. Got some interesting stuff here. I'm gonna buy two piloting now. Actually, no, I'm not gonna buy two piloting now. I take it back. So, Clone Bay covers the same deficit that level 2 piloting does in these empty ions which is the manually search the wreckage event i can hold off on that though two piloting is certainly not a bad purchase there it is manually search boom stun bomb so 25 percent chance to lose crew there but all good all right what the heck is going on over here 
think what I was supposed to do is go here and then head up and go over back this way. Seems to be... Oh, man, that, that's actually exit right there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and nine-tenths. All right, so we got one, two, let's just say three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, we'll, we'll have enough wiggle room to reach this one and dive. Cool. Yo, Necro Thunder, thank you so much for 111 months. 111. What a legend. Thank you, Necro. There won't be a next time. Open fire. I think on this one, I'm just gonna... use no parts whatsoever. Okay, is that firebomb? Dang. Oh, I need to go in here. Okay, so they got they got my cloaking down. That was my bad. Because I abandoned with the NG there and didn't recognize the doors opened. Right, fires out inside the cloaking beauty. There has been some very serious resubs today. That's very true. Let's go down here. 240 scrap aronis. Man. All right, how about with 240 scrappers, let's go ahead and get uh, four engines here at least. Okay, one more power bar right now. Just improves our cloaking evaluation. Almost that 100% magic mark. Long range scanner. Yikes. Yikes. Alright, we got some choices here. I think my first choice is going to be to use a hacking part on... Uh, shields. I think shields and a cloak is the best chance to disable everything on weapons. Okay, it didn't quite work out. Um, I'm going to go ahead and use a secondary part here in a defense drone. He might actually win that fight, dang. There we go. Boom, ba -dum, boom, 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 boom. All right, we will not accept surrender from this one. I believe in Necro Thunder. Thank you again for being such an amazing part of our channel community for so long now. Okay, a store up here. I'm in. Store time sounds awesome. If only to get a repair here. If only. 
Ooh, weapon pre-igniter is interesting. Yo, Mefo, thanks for a tier 2 22 month subscription. Thank you, thank you. I think I'm going to pick up Pre-Igniter here. Um, I'm generally not too keen on Pre-Igniter because of the cost. Uh, and, but since we only have seven lasers, being able to fire multiple sets of volleys becomes more important. And I'm thinking, like, especially phase three of the flagship fight, having an uh, initial seven damage go out towards that super shield is very nice. This also could enable us to get a slower weapon later on, like, I don't know, Halberd or Glaive or even Vulcan, depending on the situation. And we're floating the scrap right now, so let's go for it. I think Pre-Igniter can very often be a mistake to buy, but it's making some good sense here to me. Alright, how many jumps to this one? One, two, three, four, five, and that one. Okay. Uh, what I think I'm going to do is just go down this way. Yeah, this way makes more sense. Uh, Pre-Igniter be bad in a situation where the 120 scrap that you spent on it would be better served for another system, or like getting shields or something. Like, the the upfront cost of Pre-Igniter is very high compared to what 120 scrap buys you in upgrades. Is the long and the short of it. Boy, this guy's got the jukes. Yeah, that's a good way to put it. Um, pre is usually like a win more type deal. Exactly. Yeah, and, and Wolf Gamer, that's probably a fair, fair way to put it. Anytime you find pre-igniter, uh, it's very exciting, but if you have to purchase it, it's usually wrong, but not always. It's the nice thing about FTL, there's an exceptions for pretty much every item and augmentation in the game. Like, just because something's strong doesn't make it always good or an instant purchase. just means that it's powerful. Let's go ahead and attack the ship. This one will probably try to get away from us. They also have combat too, which is not a jokey setup. All right, I'm going to hack engines here. I'm gonna do four damage to shields right now.
Well, so far, so good. Didn't need cloak there. Enemy FTL charging. Alright, I'm gonna just wait for my, my hack here. Oh, uh, jump imminent? Maybe not. Okay, we're good. That was close. Alright, so we're gonna go one, two, three, four, dive. All right. Is there any more in here that are not them? That should do it. All right. Honestly, that could have gone a lot better, but we're here. Eh, I'll leave him injured for now. I'd love to sell drone parts, but it's not the correct choice. Okay, Auto Scout will 100% try to run. We're going to hack piloting here to start. Let's see where we're at with that. Okay, so I'm going to fire right away because this way we can fire again before they cloak. If I wait for my charge laser to charge there, maybe not. Hacking is seeming very good before the dive here. Long range scanner, what's up, Ferris? Alright, with Ferris being fully trained on engines, let's roll him into engines. And then I'm gonna roll the Lanius into doors. And we can have roaming repair NG right here. Ferris also grabbing a name off the list. Gonna be Rain. Hey, only Kyle. Thanks for 11 months. Pi is good for you. Thanks for 85 as well. Cheers. All right, dive coming up. Let's grab three hacking here. And I'm going to stop at 3 hacking. I should go level 2 backup battery right now as well. Okay. Yeah, thanks so much, Kayo and Pi is good for you. Appreciate that support, everybody. Thanks for the amazing stream. Alright, so here we just hack weapons. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah. 
I mean, it almost looks like we're going to go for a kill here. I don't see why not. It's an extra fuel if we get it. Might as well load one back in here, too, to make it uh, more difficult to repair. Boom, ba -dum. All right, one extra fuel and some score, too. All right, third NG controlled sector here. Awesome. Big fan of those NG guys. Okay, distresses inside the NG sector are generally beneficial. The only downside to taking distress beacons right now is that they could want fuel from us, which puts us in a very peculiar position. Even with that being said, I think we're still going for it. Beam drone. Bam. Take that. Okay, okay. Well, the truth here is replacing the charge laser with an actual functional weapon would be hmm, very nice. Or a weapon that fully charges immediately, I should say, would be very nice. So I'm semi tempted to take this store and this store. Yeah, let's just take a peek here. Okay, the halberd beam. Now, halberd beam instead of the charge laser would be, I guess, quite good versus the flagship. Arguably even much better than what we currently have, though, since we also have hacking. I think the shield is less of an issue. I don't think Halberd Beam's the one I want here. It does help for this very moment, though. Two. I can take three jumps before this store, too. Okay. Okay, I'll buy the halberd. I'm gonna buy fuel and probably exchange the weapons out at this store. Oh, let's buy one fuel here. Uh, never mind. Not enough scrap. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. I think this needs to be a shield hack. It's either a shield hack or I use double drone part, defense drone, and... What's safest here? Well, double drone part's probably safest, but I can cloak the first missile. Hmm. Kind of cruise on this ship. Okay, we got one engineer who's already in the weapons. Bear. Let's see how the opening volley goes. Tough place to be.
Okay, it's still online. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and use the defense drone here. Okay, hacking's down. Fair. Okay, at least there's a Manus repairing now. Okay, if they reboard, I want to run my Lanius into this guy. Good. Close this off. There we go. Hopefully I get a fuel here. One fuel, perfect. All right, this allows us to go one, two, three, and have at least some scrap at the store. Though our main goal at the store is just to get the halberd beam online. Which shouldn't be too bad. Don't worry, we recloninated them. Easy. Alright, let's just... <laughs> I'll take the empty jump. Empty jumps and NG sectors, and that should be pretty awesome. Um, I'm gonna ignore the station. Okay, hold up. Yeah, we gotta go to the store for fuel. How much is it to bring the halberd online? I think it's 50 right now, or 75? 75. Okay, this store is just getting fueled in. Ooh, drone recovery arm is also a very interesting pickup. Well, I could sell the charge right now and have burst laser to halberd beam and then bring the dual laser back in. My thought is if I don't sell the charge laser now, when, when am I going to bring it online? Or when am I going to be able to sell it and get a return? I'm not. Okay. Well, at least we have a pretty easy way forward here. Definitely get a devastator of a hit here. Let's just go ahead and hack uh, engines. Yeah, engines. Hack, we'll go like this. Gonna hit shields first here. That'll pull the NG onto shields. Oh my god, it's an NG boarding team. Run for your lives. I need fuel, man. Solar flare imminence. Probably not getting out before this, but maybe. Oh, we got there. Just barely. Yeah, I can do that. Thanks for the, the three fuel, even though I couldn't complete the quest. Alright, we can now bring the dual laser in. Do it. The laser's been dueled. Let's explore the asteroid field. 50 scrap, there it is. Oh, 
I'm gonna give you 15 missiles, okay? Thanks. <laughs> I barely made it out here. Awesome. Someone wanna sell to me? They don't, dang. Okay, well, this'll do. He is good enough, as long as one weapon goes down. Hey there, Bonfire. Nice to see you. Very nice. Okay, to Sector 8 we go. Alright, here in Sector 8 it works just a little bit differently. Uh, our goal is to reach and defend the base before the enemy flagship spends three turns on it. If the enemy flagship spends three turns on the base, we lose our run. Though we can kick it off at any point by fighting one of the three phases. It also takes the enemy flagship two jumps to move to any beacon. Uh, no problem. Also, every jump that happens, some beacons will be overtaken by the rebel fleet. Okay, first thing I want to do here is I want to sort my power out. I want to be able to use maybe both of these at the same time, even. Oh, the hell, let's hit repair first. Yo, B. Joe, thanks for five months, dude. Really appreciate that. Davy Jones, thanks for 71 as well. Cheers. 174. 174. Let's buy a value point in piloting and cloaking. That's where I'm going to start. Just protecting the pieces of the ship. Okay, double missile launcher Vulcan. This is going to be a double a double drone part if I've ever seen one. All right. Okay, intercepted that one good. What I'm worried about is the possible double uh, double missile firing here in a minute. Oh, if we get this halberd off, that's, that's not going to happen. That's a breach missile. Scary. Nope. You're done, son. Okay, we can cut this guy off. Cut this guy off. With the O2 off, that room's going to stay devoid. Aid the civilian ship, okay. Mind control, ooh, I can't really defend that. Huh. All right, well, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna hack the piloting here. Then I'm gonna fire its shield, start my hack, and I'm gonna pull the halberd through the mind control. I can't defend my, my doors with the Lanius being my control. Not without losing something. And when this fires, I'll cloak. Or they'll just die. That works too. Alright, 65, 63... 306 scrap right now. Okay. Uh, let's go for four shields, two power bars. I'm going to go value drone.
and two power bars after this fight. Let's sneak this part in. Okay, they dropped Ion Intruder into my drones. Okay. Don't really care. I would say worth in that case, uh, Ragged Edge is very um, <laughs> flexible what worth is in that regard, depending on the rest of your setup. War shields can be just as valuable, if not more valuable, than engines in some cases, and vice versa. Yeah, I was going to buy uh, weapon power here. I think I just buy two power bars, though, because this gives us a stable a stable defense or beam drone while we have... Uh... Yeah, that's it. I would take four shields over engines in most cases. I think especially so on the flagship. All right, let's take uh, let's take one more fight here before the flagship. Normally not too keen on doing this, but it really makes a lot of sense here. Do you, Karukin? Thanks so much for that prime sub. Hope I at least got close on your name there. Glad you're enjoying the content enough to even consider subscribing. Thank you. Okay, I'm gonna grab uh, drone power here. Another reactor power is also good, but the ability to have both drones online at the same time is pretty good. Okay, here we go. All right, let's see if we can uh, figure out where the hacking is going to land by looking at the defense drone here. That it's pointing over here makes me want to let this go. Because what's the worst target on this site? O2? We got that covered level 202. Cloaking's a little bit inconvenient, but uh, a packing part's going to get through almost certainly. So let's let it through on our terms. Oh, snap. I didn't let that turn enough. Uh, luckily, it did land on what I would call the ideal target. Sensors.
Uh, I'm just debating what I want to do here because I can fire out right now and my weapons will be charged by the time they cloak again. So I might as well do that. But where does the hat go after that? Probably just back on shields. Uh, so let's fire out right away. Okay, not bad. Let's just hit it across here and then I will send it. Right about now. All right, cloaking. I'm gonna load a beam drone here too, why not? Let's, let's hit right here and stop the cloak from happening. Nice. But one thing I didn't do very well there was kill crew. That's a fact. Let's buy two doors here. All right, now we're going to wait at the base for them to come into us. Yeah, I'm relatively sure the shield hack attaches right here. It's either that or attaches the same spot as sensors, but if I'm remembering correctly, it's here for the shield hack. This is the attachment point. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and send through shield hack. I'm gonna switch to reserve power here in a moment. Defense drones up, nice. I'm just going to load this up with backup battery power, and then I'm going to start the hack. Oh yeah, there we go. Keep it spicy. You dying? Hell yeah, dude. Way to keep it crispy, man. I could have cloaked that. Repair. Okay, now we're going to do phase three. We're going to jump into them. Here we go. This is where the pre-igniter is going to have the biggest impact on this run. It's definitely had some uh, some moments uh, since we picked it up, but right now being able to get further into the Zoltan Super Shield at the beginning of this is very huge. That's a tough place for them to board. Okay, they're in. Ooh, nasty. Okay, we're probably going to be kidnapping the crew here, if I had to guess. We'll see. I'm going to allow these to go through. In fact, I'm going to go ahead and say we are going to be kidnapping here.
Okay, another set of borders came over. Let's go repair sensors real fast. I'm actually going to uh, take some chip here to see how many are left. Like, is there another set of borders coming in? There is not. Okay, now we're going to jump back to the base with our crew on board. Yo, Norav99, thanks for 95 months. Appreciate you keeping it dapper. Thanks a lot. Okay, now we wait. There's only going to be one crew on board. So all we got to do is deal with our... Whatever gets mind controlled here. And then that's it. Go. Okay, shields being mind controlled is pretty manageable. Good hits on the missiles there. Okay, there's fire in the sensors. Can deal. Alright, he's probably dead, huh? Not? Okay, great. Uh, let's go down through mind control here. Simplify this. Okay, cloaking. Weapons got hit. Fair. Oh yeah, I didn't buy a value weapon. That's true. Luckily, though, on our next volley here, they're done. It's eight damage right there. GG. That definitely calls for some damper time. Nice. Alrighty, GG. I'll feel that throw your guesses for score there. I'm gonna say we're under 6k on that run, but it was still really solid. Yo, Pursued One, thanks for 23 months during that dapper time.
5349. Yeah, no 6k there. The Cruel Spud, number two on the NGC. Very nice, very nice. Most runs will cap somewhere around 7k for the highest score striddle, though their 8k is possible. And you can also hyperinflate your score by doing a lot of diving. So um, a naturally occurring run without any big shenanigans will probably max at 7k, and that'd be a run where you got enough scrap to max just about everything on the ship. That doesn't happen too often. Like just for example, here on my uh, my stats, if we go to top scores. My top five scores for this save, which is now about 90 runs, are all in the, the low 7,000s. Well, all right, guys, that's going to do it for today. Sorry for this being a little bit shorter than our normal fare. I just have a lot going on right now, but uh, I'm very much enjoying spending these uh, stream times together. Uh, we will be back and at it most, more than likely tomorrow. Uh, Discord for updates, as always. Uh, thanks for the amazing time today here on this Mother's Day and that very fun NGC run. We'll do it again here very soon. Uh, just thank you all very much. Thank you all for that huge amount of support today as well. Uh, catch you on the flip side. Looking forward to it already. Pin Pin slept the entire stream. What, what a lass. What a lass. Hey, thanks for that great one, guys. We'll, uh, we'll be back again soon. Uh, Dresmat, thanks for the 43 as we're signing off. Have a good one, Big Tom. Crimson Shack, Atarax, Snoozy Taka, Great Rain, Sassinian, and everybody else. You're all amazing. Appreciate you all so very much. Take her easy.